Okay, so this concludes the beginner practice. So we did uh, there's a, a warming up video that you can watch. There's this main basic practice uh, that that is this video, and then there's a cooling down video. Okay, so if you never did this, this is the first video that I'm doing. There will be other videos in the future, I hope. So if you if you catch this video roaming around the internet, there's two other videos for warming up and cooling down. But example, it's just an example of warming up and cooling down. You can do it however you want to. But it's very typical kill the warm up, except for the physical endurance or body weight exercises. And the cooling down is also pretty typical. Okay. So uh, just a disclaimer, I'll write this in the description, <laughs> but uh, this might not be the same as your typical kennel class at your own dojo. So always follow the instruction of your sensei, okay? This is how I teach beginners most of the time uh, at my dojo uh, here in Prague. Portugal, okay? Every dojo has their own way of teaching and doing the exercises for beginners, okay? Don't fret too much on it. This is just one example of an example class, okay? I'm going to do more videos with other small classes, mostly focus on beginners. We have been away for quite some time, in term, because of the coronavirus pandemic and I should have posted something sooner, I didn't. But considering that we're still uh, practicing without contact and we'll be probably practicing without contact for quite some time, I guess, uh, you can use these videos to have someone with whom to practice with. Uh, and try to do a class even if your dojo is not available at the moment or if you want to practice at all. But your sensei's uh, world is your sensei's world. So don't mind me, unless I'm your sensei. <laughs> don't mind me, look at what they do and try to follow them. Nobody can replace your sensei. They are the ones that are there for you, okay? I'm just a person in a video. The sales they should. Okay. So listen to them and you can look at other places, try to see different things, trying to learn, trying to study more kendo and trying to learn different ways of doing. But do never forget who your teacher is. Okay. Hi. Uh, so this is a, these are my last words. I'll finish it up for today. And I'm going to do now you can go with now you can go to the cooling down video. Okay? Hi. Today is